Here at Global Specialized Services, we take safety very seriously. Part of our continuing education for our drivers is to update them on changing safety technologies. One that we're seeing being implemented in our area is the CatchNet system. This system is replacing some of the runaway truck ramps because of its effectiveness and other safety advantages over the traditional inclined gravel runaways that we're used to seeing. Here is the entrance to the catch net system. Please note that it may look close as the nets look like actual barriers. Please do not be deterred by the nets. These are going to catch, slow, and safely stop you and the truck you are in. This catch net is located on US 16 west of Buffalo, Wyoming. There is also a brake check pullout at the top of the hill that all commercial motor vehicles are required to stop at. In this slide, we can see three instances where the catch net has been used. All these vehicles were able to be driven off of the mountain. If for some reason you need to use this catch net system, it is important you attempt to hit the center of the catch net. This will help utilize the stopping power of the catch net to its fullest potential. The system slows trucks by deforming a metal tape. The deformation of this metal requires a vast amount of energy, which is used to slow the vehicle. Currently, the catch net in Buffalo, Wyoming is capable of stopping a 90,000 pound truck traveling at 90 miles per hour. There are plans to increase its capabilities. In this slide, we can see several trucks that didn't utilize the catch net system. You can see the results speak for themselves. Unfortunately, these crashes resulted in four fatalities. Please don't be a statistic. Use the catch net if needed. Coming up, you will see a live demonstration of the CatchNet system by the Ontario Department of Transportation. Result in uh, injuries, perhaps deaths. The dragnet system has a total of seven nets. The demonstration truck stopped by using just four of them. Each canister contains a spool of 200 feet of metal tape. Not one of the canisters used a full spool. The truck stopped within 200 feet. The demonstration takes less than five seconds. The load is intact and the driver walks away without injury. This video is produced in partnership with the Wyoming Transportation Safety Coalition with the aim of reducing Wyoming's road fatalities and Global Specialized Services, a heavy haul crane and rigging company.